Today we're going to check out the new episode of Gundam, The Witch from Mercury. Let's jump into it. Look at but before we do, if you've seen my videos before, maybe consider subscribing to the channel because we're trying to hit 25,000 subscribers by the end of the year, and that's very possible with your help. And if you like this video, then like and comment because that helps too. And you can find the full length as well as exclusives over on Patreon. <laughs> oh yeah, and then the proposal. <laughs> She's trying to steal my girl. <laughs> or he's trying to steal my girl. Wait, not like that? Damn. Somebody jelly. I think in like the last episode reaction we did, I said that I didn't want to see a, a lot of the duels. When I said that, I didn't mean I don't want to see mech fights. Obviously, that's what I'm here for if it's Gundam. What I meant was I want higher stakes than just school duels. You, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's what I that's what I meant. I want some higher stakes shit. I want some bigger than just we're fighting to to be married type of shit. Yeah, you, you know what I'm saying? Higher stakes. That's all I ever meant by that. So I'm pretty sure that's what I said in the last one. I think people misunderstood what I meant, but that's OK. Now they're in a Zoom call here. Oh, I had plenty of time to read it. I did not know that. Oof. He mad as shit. This motherfucker lost twice to this bitch. <laughs> she has to stand out now. This man's jacket is so flowy. Keep telling yourself that. <laughs> hey man, I get where she's coming from. This man just said he he wanted to marry her and now he's being a big baby. I don't know, he's being a little soon daddy, I guess. I like this Daft Punk produced uh soundtrack. Whoa, what is this? These bitches did this, didn't they? Damn, what the fuck? Teachers can't see that shit? Teachers not gonna instantly like not do something? What? I swear, the one thing that makes me so mad about anime, bro, the teachers are like complicit with, with bullying. They're like, they allow this shit. They just like, they're like, all right, sounds good to me. Oh, this is a very weird thing that happened. Couldn't possibly be bullying. Like, shit makes me so mad. I need a squad. Sorry, I already work with someone else. Hey, we got some peeps out here. What is this little fucking... A goat's gonna help her? Ah! <laughs> it just fucking screams at her. <laughs> Hey, it's a fucking cotton candy head. Bro, there's so many names, bro. Y'all just flooded my shit with names. She's so racist. Can you not, please? Damn. I guess it technically doesn't make her racist. It makes her discriminatory based on birthplace. That's more because she gets discriminated against than anything else. Hey, it's the guy that says that he'll never fall in love. <laughs> Damn, dude. The disrespect. He's my friend! If you're nice to her for just a moment, then she's like, we're friends now. Damn, she memorized a manual? And why she got trash everywhere, bro? Bro, she living life like a streamer. What is this, bro? Got trash all over the place, drinks, food, leftover. It looks like that. It looks like fucking XQC's uh, stream setup. What is this, man? At least she had her trash in bags, though. For the most part. Bro. 
Mobile suits would literally crush people. What the fuck? This is this America? Oh shit, maybe. Yo, to be honest, there's probably like hella money to be made in space. Like asteroids have like minerals like a motherfucker. Probably so much money could be made by mining an asteroid. Aww. Aww. She's got everybody back home. Reading for her. That's a letter? What's she doing? She's studying. Young people come to Mercury? Wouldn't Mercury be really fucking hot? That's really close to the sun. I don't understand the science of somebody possibly being from Mercury. Wow, punch her in the fucking mouth. She talking hella shit, bro. Ooh, get wrecked. Get wrecked. I hate these girls, dude. I, I want them to die, both of them. I want a fucking uh, mech to just step on them. Bro, I want her to just pull out a boom, boom, just blast them. Kill them bitches. Bro, is nothing gonna happen to these girls, bro? I understand this is supposed to be like perseverance, but like, can you just guide her to the girls so that way they get stepped on? Time's up. <sighs> Bullying in anime makes me so fucking mad, dude. <laughs> That's, it makes me so mad. What does it take to clean that shit off? I know the one dude said that like it's not an easy thing to clean off, but like, is it really that hard? How is she able to hear all this shit? I don't understand how that one girl is like. Please blast them, bitches. Yes! The other one, too. The other one, too. Punch that other bitch, too, dude. Yes! <laughs> yes! Oh, I don't like that. I don't like her getting hit, too, but yes, let's go, dude. Yes! I love it, dude. I'm good now. I'm happy now. I'm chilling now. I'm chilling now. Choo Choo's A, man. We fuck with Choo Choo and her cotton candy head ass. Let's go, dude. You didn't do shit. <laughs> that felt good. Like you didn't do anything. What are you what are you talking about? What happened? Wait, wait. Okay, wait, hold on. I missed it. I missed it. She said something. Would you like to join Earth House? Oh, let's go. Awesome. Choo Choo has to be okay with it, can't, doesn't she? Aww. That's her way of saying you're allowed to join us. <laughs> Aw, hey, I like it. That was good. That was good. This was a good episode. For as much as I was just like so angry and like half half cringe, half angry when I see bullying in anime. It's just bullying in general, but like normally it's not something that lasts a long time. So in shows, movies, you know, it happens for a moment and then they move on. In anime, this is how it usually goes too. Initial bullying and then a character has to persevere through it, trying to, to, to stand up to that bullying 
for an extended period of time. And that's why I get so fucking mad because it's not just, oh, 30 seconds and then we move on and, you know, they confront the bullies or something or, or they, you know, move on past that scene. No, no, no. They'll spend two, three, four, five minutes dealing with whatever it, whatever is being caused by these bullies. Dealing with the bully, essentially. It's like, bro, I just, please, just fucking, just makes me mad, bro. It just, it just makes me mad, you know? When Choo Choo goes over there and punches him in the face, I couldn't be more satisfied. That was awesome. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it so much. That was great. I'm so happy to see that. This was not like a crazy good episode. This was this episode was focused primarily on trying to get our main girl, Saleta, introduced to the Earthians. That's the group she's going to be with, the Earthians. Because there's two different divisions of people. You've got Earthians and then all, everybody else in space. The Spatians. It's not like Earthians, Mercurians, Jupiterians. I don't know what the fuck you would call them. I'm just making it up. Martians. No, it's not all. No, no, no. It's Earthians, Spatians. Because everybody that's not from Earth looks down on the people that are from Earth. Which is crazy because I feel like Earth is probably where all of this technology started. And by probably, I mean definitely because these motherfuckers didn't just like show up from another solar system. Like... It's really annoying, but I guess maybe they look down on him because, oh, you never got the chance to leave Earth? <laughs> uh, my family's been off of that wretched planet for six years. Six, six thousand years. Ugh. She's gonna be working with the Earthians now, and Midione is gonna also be kind of in that as well. I mean, she's not gonna be in this, the Earthian house, but since she is the bride of Saleta, and probably Saleta's only like real friend, Saleta don't really got friends. And so I think that, you know, they'll they'll learn to probably be more okay with Midione. That's good because she ain't really got friends either. So with that said, I'd love to know what you all thought about this one down in the comments below. Specifically, do you get really fucking frustrated watching Bully? And also, how did you feel about Choo Choo sticking up for our girl and whooping those bitches asses? Let me know in the comments below. And as always, if you enjoyed the video, then like the video and subscribe to the channel with notifications on so you don't miss another one. And until next time, make sure you all keep it fresh. Peace.